Cyber attacks. At times they can be obvious. Their goal can be to intimidate or even send a message. At other times it can appear innocent, even seductive, with a goal of enticing someone to expose them and leave their devices vulnerable. Such as with this campaign engineered by Hamas to hack IDF soldiers through online deceit. This is not the first time Hamas has tried to hack the phones of IDF soldiers. Now we have identified stronger social engineering, the use of new hacking platforms like Telegram. The information security array of the IDF's intelligence directorate has identified a total of six characters used by Hamas to entice IDF soldiers. The different accounts would contact IDF soldiers through Telegram. They would start innocent conversations, then the Hamas operative would ask to send photos to the soldier, but on a different app. The goal was to have the IDF soldiers download another application that would then actually hack the phone, obtain all files and GPS location. The IDF identified three malicious apps which Hamas used in order to spread the malware. In recent months, we have identified the repetitive activity of a fake online figure, which we identified as a Hamas operative from 2018. In light of this latest cyber attack attempt, the IDF has refined its guidelines for maintaining information security for each IDF soldier. Hamas was able to conduct conversations with hundreds of soldiers and officers. The IDF says that for now, no damage was caused, but that all those who engage in these conversations would have to be questioned and have their phones freed from the malware.